Hello my darlings and welcome back to San My Shuno. We are back in the Uptown area today. Last time we finished up the Hamptons kitchen area, the entrance hall and also the main hallway. Today we're going to be concentrating only on the main bedroom and the ensuite bathroom. So let's get in and start furnishing. Happy Wednesday my darlings and welcome back once again to Let's Build the Bloody World. Mixed it up a little bit there, you know, remix. Hello, here we are back at the Hamptons apartment today. Obviously yesterday we continued on and finished up the kitchen. They are in the midst of cooking something at the minute. Um, today, all we're going to be getting done today is the main bedroom and also the dressing room and their ensuite as well. So this is the area we're going to be concentrating on today. And then while I'm away, I'm going to bring out a video, a Let's Put the Worlds video. And we're going to do the two teen bedrooms together. So that's what's going to be happening. Yes, it is. Let's get rid of these weird lights for a start. And let's make a bloody start as far as I'm concerned. Yes, indeed. Um, Hello. Absolutely hello to all of you. You might be wondering what's coming up this week on the channel. Well, we're going to be doing a little speed build where we're going to be renovating Lorena and Dorothy's house over in the Spice District. If you remember, we had that old brownstone that we needed to renovate. So that's going to be a little speed build coming this week. And I'm also going to be renovating one of the university dorms. So that's coming up too. So be on the looks out for them, my darlings. Yes, I will. Yes. Anyway, here we are. Uh, definitely want some curtains in this room. And I think this is going to be the curtain of the apartment. This one here is just going to fit in with the aesthetics that I want and we're absolutely for it. And there we go. There we go. I'm happy with the curtains like that. We can just pretend that you can draw them across. Now I did trial this bed in here and it just doesn't fit in with the aesthetics. It really, really doesn't. So I think we're going to just stick with the same kind of like softer, very pale vibe that we've got going on here with like hints of blacks and whatnot. So that's what we're going to do. So I think the only bed in question that we can pull out for this room is going to be this one, isn't it? It's got to be this one here for this room. Or we could even try the other one that it came with. Oh, or even this one would work in here. We've got options, loves. This is the one I was thinking of. Oh, do you know what? I think that one might work. What colours do you come in? I, being high school years, probably everything's going to be too much or too much and i just don't think that yet that one's out the, that one's out of the running and um, this wood tones let's sit in a little bit weird for me i mean we could go green with the bedding but i would prefer the bedding to be all in white oh do you know what that bed there is looking lovely that bed there is looking delicious in here oh i like both of them i like this tone and that one but mm, oh i don't know i kind of like the the way that this is higher up like the bed head is the headboard is higher up. I think that suits. But I also love that colour in this room. I think it really, really works as well. Oh, I kind of like this one a bit more. Yeah, we're going to do this one. I like that bed, but I think this one here just fits in with the aesthetics we've got going a little bit better, doesn't it, darlings? Yes, it does. Now, can we trial out the new uh, side tables in here? You know? Oh, and I love that you can filter everything now for the packs and the kit packs. That has made a massive difference. I've been able to do that because I'm a slut for mods um so twisted mexi's mod a uh, bit of build and buy always allowed me to do that oh i kind of like them in black in here what's this one here oh that's got gold on it what about the gray oh that's got gold on it as well i kind of like the black side tables in here is that the right side table though or do i just want to use it because it's new let me see what else i can find Oh, I kind of like these ones here. I like these ones from Dream Home Decorator. Not going to do it in a black because I'm thinking about adding some pendulous lights hanging down or even um, some wall lights in black instead just to get that black accent coming through in here. Let's have a little look. I think these tables are perfect for this room though. Yes, but you do need to just come in just a little bit, my love. Little bit. Oh yeah, I'm vibing with that. Um, I'm also going to be putting out a post everywhere, Twitter, um, the community tab and stuff just so people know that i am away and i'm going to give you the dates that i'm going to be away as well because it might eat into the week after and stuff i'll put i'll put it out there loves i'm going on holiday next wednesday from wet till wednesday so i'm going to be away for eight days really or it's going to be tuesday till wednesday um so yeah just i'll get it out so you all know where you are or where i am even <laughs> um 
and also follow me on my Instagram because I'm going to be putting up some lovely pictures. You should see that we're staying in a villa this time and this villa is gorgeous. It's got an infinity pool that looks over the mountains and stuff. It's absolutely stunning. And for the, like, it was cheaper than getting a fucking hotel, loves. It really, really was. So I'm going to keep looking. Um, Whenever I go away, I'm going to keep looking on like Airbnb for villas and stuff because it worked out so much cheaper than getting a hotel. Um, but yeah, keep an eye out on my Instagram because I'm going to be slutting it up with some pics. Um, yeah, the end. What a lovely sentence that was. Oh, I cut. do you like them? I do. I do. Look at me agreeing with myself. I do. I do like them in here. I think it adds just something delicious. Delicious into this room. <laughs> yeah, I am kind of vibing with that. I think we need another bit of art up on the top here. So let me find something. Mm, I'm kind of vibing with this one from dream home decorator i think it might be a little bit too big i think we need to size it down just a little uh i like this swatch as well i looked through all of the swatches and i think that one there just works in here yeah i'm into that i'm absolutely into that one i really am i think we should maybe put a plant over in this corner by the window and maybe a chair over in this one this is quite a big room so i do have a lot of room to fill so i don't really want to squidge a chair in there actually we can make this in a bit more of a, a, a a sitting room within a bedroom do you know what i mean like a, just a little moment in the middle i think that would be nice yeah i'm into that so plant we'll go for this one here from blooming rooms i think that's just going to look nice with the again bringing in that black accent that i do want everywhere oh i'm for it yes indeed still need something over here but i don't know what i want to put in that corner just yet i think what we need to do is figure out a kind of like a living room area here and um, because they've got their own like walk-in like dressing room and stuff, it doesn't really make sense to have wardrobes. I could maybe have a dresser out here somewhere, but I do want to get a living room in. So let's find some sofas. Oh, I'm kind of vibing with this one from the book uh, Nook Kit. It looks like it's going to be some kind of like fold-out bed. Is that what it's supposed to be? I have no idea. No idea, but we're going to use it anyway. I think we'll do two. We'll do two. I think what orientation would I want this in? Probably here. Probably here. And I'll put a nice rug and a coffee table here as well i definitely think we should do a dresser now i keep looking over this area i do think a dresser in this area would be very nice indeed yeah i like that but i think i'm gonna widen it out there like that yes okay coffee table um let's find one together let's find one actually together what about this i mean i use this one to death but it is a lovely coffee table i could even make that in black maybe just to bring that accent over Oh, I do like that. I do like that. I like the harshness of that. But I reckon we could do even better. I reckon we could do better than that, darlings. Oh, let me see you. Are you a bit big for any here? You're a bit big. You are a bit big. Maybe this one. Is that Does that come in a pure black? It does. That one's nice as well. Well, I kind of vibing with that one too. Um, What other choices do we have here? Even the Moschino one could work in this room. I do like that. I do. Why did I make those kissy noises with my mouth? I just heard that. And I've, I'm a, I apologize to anybody who cringed at that out there. Has anybody seen those TikToks where those men like speak to the camera, but they make those noises with their mouths? <sighs> I would I would go nuts if someone did that in front of me. I really would. Unless it was a really cute animal. <laughs> I can hear an animal like smack their lips and eat loudly and think it is the cutest thing on the planet you know like when you see like french bulldogs eat like a watermelon <gasps> absolutely for it but if there's a human doing that i literally want to slap them sorry if i'm spinning around i'm just trying to get the the vibe in here i do like that actually i do i think it needs a lamp in here as well i might even go for the same lamp as what we've got in the living room in this room because i think it could work let me just flop you down to there bring you in and then twist you into a better position Oh, yeah, I do like that. Yeah, that looks good in here. It really does. We need some kind of like art installation up there. Like some kind of like, not painting or even a painting, but some kind of wall decoration. And as for dresses, I'm going to do two dresses over this side. I think it could handle it, maybe. Let me see. Um, I don't know what dresses to use just yet, though. Two of them were just a bit overkill, but we've gone for this one here from the high school years. I just think that suits the room nicely. And I decided not doing it like a black accent there. I think I'm going to look for the black accent. In How many times are we going to say black accent? That's what I want to know. We're going to look for a nice thing up there 
And I want to do something up here as well, but I don't know what I want to do there just yet. So let's have a little look around for a few bits and bobs to throw around the room. So that's what I decided to do. I put in a little black accent chair over in the corner, a little a little plant. I've put up some dry flowers on top of this unit. We've used this like tapestry over here. I put this rug down as well from the new from the new kit pack. I thought that kind of suited the vibe in here quite nicely. And I decided I'm going for this picture here. So it's the same artist as the rest of them. Oh, it's the same picture as that. I didn't even realize that. I thought I thought I got away with that. Oh no. Do we have something that we haven't used? Have we used you? We've used you. Oh no. Well, I've used you. Definitely used you. Not used you though. Let me see this. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that goes. Yeah, kind of happy with that. And now that I've done this room, I was like, oh, they're going to need a station to be able to do their vlogs and stuff off. I'm going to give the like the teens one each anyway. But I was like, I don't really want the parents going in and having to record their videos and stuff there. It's just not going to it's not going to make sense. So I changed around the living room a little bit more and um, put this here. So they got that. I'm going to make sure everything's upgraded with the best cameras and whatnot. Um, move the piano over to this way. Put the piano underneath of there and then put the record player over on this side here just to like mix it up and then they've got their own area where they can come and record their videos as well you know because the kids are going to have their own so it only makes sense to give the parents somewhere to do this isn't it yes we're done lovely so dressing room i think what i would want to do we need some kind of softness on the floor here um that fluffy squared rug would probably fit good in here i just don't want to do it in a black i think we should do it in that color yes and then have two mirrors on either side of the door there because there's not really much space here to be able to put mirrors apart from there so i don't really want to swallow this whole room up with a mirror though because in my head i was going to use these ones here and i just think that would be too much for this room yeah i think maybe we should use the eco lifestyle one the oh actually what about you oh that does kind of lean though i'm not really a fan of the lean in here no it doesn't work with the shape of this room so we're going to play it safe and we're going to go for this one either side so at least they'll have one each and then they've got a little place to look at check out what they're wearing then as well yes that's nice little moment coming through here as well and then they've got this big ensuite so i definitely want to do a bow a bower a bow i've said it again i've said that before and I'm saying it again. We're going to put a bower in, which is a shower bath combo in my head for some reason. Um, we're going to stick with a black and white theme in here, I think. Yes, I enjoy that. Yes. In fact, I don't like those tiles at the back there. Can I just scoot you in like that? Oh, there we go. Yes. Just so it kind of... Yes, there we are. Lovely. Very long room, this. Very long room indeed, but I'm kind of fine with that. I think what we should do is... Do you know what? Actually, I've changed my mind. We're going to do a bath, a bath and shower, not a bower. We're going to do a bath and shower. So let's go for some black accents. Let's go for this black bath in here like this. Yes. Oh, maybe this is where I can put that mirror. We could do those, these mirrors behind the bath. Should we go up higher? Uh, or is that a bit dramatic? That's a bit dramatic. If I can use these then. Should I just do one? Let me see what two would look like. No, two is going to be the way. Yep. Two there. Wouldn't want to clean this mirror next to the bath. It would infuriate me. But this is The Sims and it's not real life. The end. Um, And then I want to do... Uh, I'm going to do a platform. We're going to do a platform. And we are going to... I think I want to... Can we go down in an apartment? I can't remember. Oh, we can. Oh, we can. Well, we'll do that then. We will do that. We'll go down to there. I am going to pick out a better trim for that platform. Maybe maybe a black brick. Is that not doing it on that side? Oh, it's got that weird thing on it. Well, maybe just this then. Uh, this one. Have a look. Yeah, I think that's okay. Or should we go for white? Oh, the options. Well, the white's not going to look white because Sims, is it? So I think we'll, we'll, we'll just play it safe. We'll go for that. I'm going to color the floor black. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have black tiles in here on the floor. Yes. Yes, that's better. That set it in a little bit better. And then I'm going to do a double shower. I'm going to do a double shower in this one in black, obviously. And I'm going to whip you to there and there like that. And then, oh, do you know what? 
<gasps> Maybe I could use a window instead of doing the um, screen from Snowy Escape. Let's do that. Let's do a medium height uh, window. Maybe this one. Oh, this is going to be a pain in the ass to get this on. Um, can I? No. Hmm. I can't be asked to move this with the tool mod either. I need to think of something else. Decided against a double shower. It just wasn't working with what I wanted to do with this window. Um, so I've gone for a single one instead. And that's fine. That's absolutely fine. It's fitting in deliciously. Uh, I would love two sinks in here, but it's just going to be a bit of a squidge. We might be able to do it. Let's give it a go. But I think it's going to be a little bit too much of a squidge for two sinks. And oh, do you know what? Actually, it's going to be okay. Tell a lie. Tell a little white lie. It's going to be okay. I'm going to put in the, the uh, bath there. They should be able to get in there. No problem. Yeah. It's a little bit squidged. I could maybe move it along one more. Let's just get you away from there. Yeah, I think that'll work. That's going to work deliciously. And I think, oh, maybe even like a landscape. Yes, a landscape black mirror above it. Let's flop you in there. Just above there like that. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Mmm. And then towels. Um, no, I don't want to add you. It needs to be just a nice modern. I'm going to go for a pure white towel. There we go. One there. And I think I'll add one on the other side where the uh, bath is as well. Yes, that's going to vibe nicely. Oh, well, this has came along a lot easier than what I thought it was going to. I thought this was going to be a bit of a bitch, but it wasn't. It was fine. Absolutely spiffingly fine. But you know me in bathrooms, I just don't like doing them. No idea. Can I put a window here? Can we do that? We're not allowed, are we? We're not allowed. No, not allowed. They told us we're not allowed. Um, let me just see. It's not going to allow me to put it there. Well, and I'm not moving it with the tool mod. I can't be asked. It's an absolute pain in the ass. That's fine. Yeah, okay. One bathroom. One ensuite bathroom. And one main bedroom. We're done for today, my sweethearts. Oh, I'm very happy with how that came out. I do like that bedroom. It's very nice. Very nice indeed. Let's get a nice little shop to leave on. Oh, maybe this one. Oh, that's very delicious. Yes. Anyway, my loves, thank you so much for watching today. I appreciate you. Leave me some lovely comments down below. And I will be back tomorrow with a kind of let's build the world's speed build crossover. So look out for that one. Goodbye.